set up. So I'm back and I'm gonna try to figure this out because the issue is when you go in here, launch control is disabled. So I was looking up some different ways to see if I can get it on. So the thing is, I said you got to put it in sport. So we're in sport, sport or track. So well, I'm put it in track. You gotta press this twice to get into competitive mode and it should open a menu. And I'm thinking mine won't open the menu. Well, there we go. Press accelerator, then release brake to launch. Okay, so looks like it does work. Launch control, custom line lock. All right. Automatic. Let's see. So it'll let you do line lock, which is pretty dope. I would do some burnouts, but I'm at the gas station right now, so it probably would be a bad look. But fully apply. Huh. What? I guess now I need to uh, figure this out. Front wheels locked, release brakes. So now the car is stopped. You get 15 seconds to uh, do whatever kind of burnout you want. And when you're done, you gotta press this button and press this button. Or press them at the same time, however. And then you start back rolling, so. So that's pretty dope. Uh, so yeah, basically you gotta be in park first to set up launch control, which is what I've been doing wrong this whole time. I've been in drive, just holding the brake, sitting still. So, launch RPM 2000, all right. Uh, slip target 10%, whatever. Okay, so. Park, track mode, uh, trash control off, hit it twice until the menu pops up. And then you can do whatever you want. So I guess now it's just time to find a spot to really test this out. So press accelerator, then release brake. Yep. All right. So let me go find a spot to try this out at real quick. All right. So I got a spot. Hold your brake. Step on the gas. That's how you do launch control. Alright, so I'm gonna try this line lock now. So you just hold the brake all the way down. Front wheel is locked. Let go of the brake. Step on the gas. All right. Let's try this line lock out. Brake all the way. figure this out all right so some kind of way I'm struggling with the line lock but I, I got it sort of the last way like I don't know what I did wrong the first time but I guess you can't just step on it you gotta kind of ease into it so you ease into it then it'll start spinning which I don't know if I caught that on if I recorded that part or not I, was, I don't know but it worked so that's, that's pretty dope that it's got that and uh you can actually take your foot off the brake and just focus on hitting your gas and doing your burnout and your wheels are going to stay locked in the front so it's actually no problem but the launch control i figured that out got it working and i'm good on launch control the, uh, i guess the sad part is i got to take this car back tomorrow but at least i figured it out and you know hopefully this will 
to let you be able to do it in yours or if you just want to see how it works, you know, this is it's something to see. But uh I might try it a couple more times before I take it in and like and uh take this car back tomorrow. But overall it's a pretty pretty fun car to have. It's uh kinda bulky, like it's a lot bigger than, than I got a C5 yet if you hadn't seen it in the other videos. So it's a it's a big difference compared to a C5 as far as like size and the fact that I don't have to basically sit on the floor to get inside of this one. So it's it's a completely different world, but uh but yeah. Fun car though. Alright, so I don't know if y'all saw it in the other video, but if you do if you mess up on this, it'll knock on the e-brake. So, I'm going to go ahead and put this in drive. So, once your brake is down all the way, your wheels are locked. So, I'm not on the brake now. Uh, let's just say I tap the gas and hit the brake. It'll automatically put the e-brake on. So, that's just if you mess up. So, then you just got to hold the brake again. Pull this back. And your e-brake is, well, should be off. Uh, dismiss that first. Uh, you push it forward, don't pull it back. When you push it forward, now your parking brake is released and you can start over. But just a heads up, if you, do, if you mess up, it will kick that into... Uh, Like if, and the mess up is if you hit the brakes so if you get off of it hit the brakes again it will knock on the e-brake so you know just beware of that 